I think, you know, you know, the great thing of, uh, about being me at this time is like, you know, I recognize things that I never recognized in the past. And it's important to recognize certain things in your life and give them respect, give them compassion and give them credit, you know, because I, I think people don't give themselves enough credit for, for a lot of the things that people I mean, you know, do. it's just, I've, I've, I recognize that whatever happens in my life, I will just always be playing guitar. I will always be making music because that's what, that's what, that's my calling. I recognize that, you know, this is my universal calling is just to play, play music with or without anyone. This is what I do. And to me, the, the realization of that, and I realized this friggin' like maybe 10, 15 years ago, that this really was the only option I, I have in my life, was great. You know, because like, you know, there's no questions about, about you know, am I doing, why, why am I doing this? It's just like, you know, because to play music, to be in this industry, to be in a band, you, there's, you have to commit and you have to make so much personal sacrifice and there's no guarantee of success and you might get killed in the process, you know? And that's what being in this business is like, you know? And I only say that, I can only say that now looking back because, you know, 40 years ago, what I saw was a bunch of kids who were hungry, innocent, and had something to say, you know, and had like energy. And we all started off in, like on the same sort of like page. But, you know, because of the industry, because uh, of, of the music, you know, because of uh, popularity status, you know, sex, drugs, rock and roll, not all of us made it to this point. Some people got fucking devoured and spit out. Some people just got devoured and like never came back. You know, I got extremely affected by it. You know, other people in the band got extremely affected by it. I think, I feel like I'm a fucking survivor. And I think that every one of us in this band is a survivor because, man, it's a, a, a screwed up industry. And, you know, my kids are really, like, really, like, sensitive and shy. Like me. I wouldn't, I wouldn't push them into this. I don't push my kids into music or, you know, into going into this career. Because, you know, I don't... <laughs> yeah, it's been amazing, you know. This side is amazing. And everyone always sees this side. But you gotta friggin', you know... Be aware of this side too. And this side almost freaking killed me. You know, if I push my kids into this, you know, there's no guarantee they're going to have the same success as I am. And, you know, the other side of it, there's more of a guarantee of that happening. So I don't want that. I don't want my kids to be subject to that. You know, the other guy's kids are different from my kids, you know, and I think... You know, Rob's kids and Ty in general, he's like a perfect example of some, you know, a kid who's just like grown up in this business and already already know, knows what he wants. The support of, of uh, you know, of his, of his family, you know, Rob and Chloe. And, and, and that's great. When I started off, I didn't have the full support of my family. And I, I doubted if any, you know, any of the rest of us did. In fact, my mom hated it when she found out I was, I was thinking of becoming a musician. Literally, she like, like yelled at me for two or three hours saying, what are you doing? You know, are you nuts? And I was just like, yeah. you know. Yeah. But it's, you know, it's also the recognition that, you know, that, 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 you know, culturally, you know, I represent something. You know, every one of us represents something. And, you know, people need need that. They need to, like, see someone and, like, you know, and, and have, you know, that person mean something in their lives. That is super, super important, too. And that's another reason why I think that, you know, we should just never stop. 
because we we bring meaning to people's lives you know fucking ufo michael shanker brought so much meaning to my life you know this is it was just the band it was just music it was just entertainment but Freaking hell, it was like a lifeline to me.